We conditioned Rory to associate a clicker with food. Lead him through, lead him through. Rory explored the maze, so when he was given a treat at the end, he ran it faster. Come on, come on, go, go, go! We gave Rory food to reinforce him for doing tricks. We used food as a primary <laughs> reinforcer for Rory. The clicker meant nothing to Rory at first. When we put Rory in the Skinner box, he learned to press the bar for a pellet. Rory reacts the same to both my hand and to food. We give Rory a treat every time he touches the ball so that he keeps doing it. That rat's so big. Rory learned to press the bar five times in a row to get a pellet. Good job! Rory crossed the dowel rod to get to his house. Rory didn't know how many times he had to press the bar to get a reward. We linked together a series of tricks for Rory to perform in a row. Rory learned that when he touched the ball, he would get food. Rory ran through the maze to prevent being tapped. That was close. Rory learns that rolling the ball into the basket gets him a food. When Rory forgot where to run, we reminded him with a clicker. We rewarded Rory by letting him run on his wheel. A little more running, a little more running. Good! Good That's job! It. We rewarded Rory step by step, first for touching the ball and then for rolling it. <laughs> Extinction occurred when Rory stopped doing the tricks. When Rory wasn't behaving, we used an annoying push to correct his behavior. <laughs> Rory, come on, come on, come on, for the camera, for the camera, for the camera, for the camera. <laughs>